In this video, I'm going to teach you how to configure ODBC to access Microsoft SQL Server. So for that, first you need to open Microsoft SQL Server. So this is my Microsoft SQL Server. So after that, we need to create new database name in Microsoft SQL Server. So to create the new database name, for that you need to click on this new query. And after that here, type here, create database. And my database name will be most double tree. And after that, click on execute button. And here you can see the message says that command completed successfully. So now we are going to open that is ODBC. To open ODBC on your system, on your laptop, desktop, and here you can see call search bar. This is the search bar. Type here ODBC. And after that, click on here. And after that, click on add. And after that, click on SQL Server. Finish. And after that, here you need to mention your database name. That my database name, I need to mention here. So to get database name, for that, go back here or else you can copy this otherwise you can click on this database right click and refresh it and expand it and here you can see this is my database name most tree tree so let me go back and i need to type here most double tree and here i need to paste my server url to get the server url for that click on here on microsoft sql server right click on it and after that here you can see call properties and after that here you can see this is my server name just copy and go back to odbc and paste it here and after that click on next and after that again click on next and after that click on change the default database to select here this is my database name and after that click on next button and after that change the language of SQL Server system message to English and click on finish and after that click on again test data source and here you can see test results test completed successfully click on OK and after that click on ok again click on ok and click on ok so guys in this way where you can create new database name and you can configure your database you know to odbc so guys thank you so much for watching my video so if you learn any new thing from this video so don't forget to subscribe my channel see you in the next video bye bye